And as if buying or selling a home weren't stressful enough, a booming housing market has created an increase in prices and a decrease in inventory. Our Reed Gregory tells us more. Back in June 20, uh, 2020, the average days of houses on the market was 42. That's down to 10. So houses are selling wow. for more and they're selling faster. It's no secret that the housing market right now is booming. Some houses selling in just under a week of hitting the market. But why? So many people have shifted the way that they're living now. Kids are, you know, now working from home instead of going to school, you know, to do their actual schoolwork. Um, a lot of parents are actually transitioning where they're working from home, so they need a little more space. With the influx of buying and selling throughout the industry, brokers and agents admit it can be a bit frustrating on both sides. And you do get frustrated um, buyers because they are, you know, pre-qualified, they're ready to buy a house, and you're going to go look at a house you can afford, and now you find out, you know, there's maybe 10 other offers and people are you know increasing the price and that puts it out of their range they can't maybe reach that high with no exact timetable as to when the market will cool down a bit agents are offering some simple words of wisdom be patient first thing i would say is patience you know kind of kind of um understand where your finances are know what you can like where where is your top like where are you comfortable kind of maxing out at but also make sure that you're finding the right house you know you don't just want to be thrown into something just because it was available or because you looked at it and kind of liked it. Needless to say, if you are a seller in the market today, this is all great news for you. Reporting for News Press Now, I'm Reed Gregory.